In a world of 6.8 billion people, more than 3 billion rely on wood, dung, and other biomass as a primary source of fuel. Half of the world population that's using biomass fuels, um, we now understand, uh, exposes itself to quite a bit of air pollution. Globally, exposure to indoor air pollution causes the premature deaths of more than 1.6 million people every year. That is one person every 20 seconds. A rather large range of health risks have been associated with this exposure, uh, including tuberculosis, uh, cancers, uh, low birth weight in children whose mothers were exposed during pregnancy, uh, cataracts, you know, eye diseases, even uh, some association with asthma. In India, 150 million households cook indoors using biomass fuels women and children suffer most. Improving the design of traditional cook stoves can not only decrease fuel consumption, but can dramatically reduce the amount of smoke and toxic substances they are exposed to. The wood can be burned very cleanly. Uh, it has almost no contaminants in it. You really need an upgrade in the technology to get an upgrade in the performance. The problem of indoor air pollution is so large that there's not enough charitable money in the world to give away clean stoves to all the households. Therefore, you have to find a way to do it on a sustainable basis. So the Foundation's Breathing Space program aims to significantly reduce indoor air pollution through a market-based approach and a commercially viable solution to the market. This means that we bring together a coalition of partners through NGOs, through the private sector, through financial institutions to manufacture and market these products, uh, which are primarily improved cooking stoves. The new aspect or the unique thing that's being tried in this approach is, is the market-based approach where you're trying to set up a more sustainable system for service delivery. You're catering to uh, consumer needs and the economics in these rural households, providing them with a range of options. The key is finding the right partners and being able to work with the right people. That's what's actually, that's what's going to make the difference. The will is there. Um, awareness of this issue is growing. Um, there is money. People are prepared to invest in it and, and, and that's exciting. This project in India is truly paving the way for a solution on indoor air pollution around the world. The solution will be a sustainable solution and will help us improve the quality of life of many families around the world. Women and, children and their children should not die as a result of cooking meals for their family. It should not happen. <laughs>